Hello, this is Eric Amundsen, and I'm going to show you uh, how to embed the Bing Translator widget in your WordPress site using a WordPress widget. Um, so I have installed the Bing Translator plugin and checked my settings here. So by far the easiest way to embed it into a site is by going to Appearance and Widgets. And what you see here is on the left-hand side a list of all widgets that are available on the site, and on the right-hand side a list of all available widget-enabled areas on the site. So I've already checked this out, and I want my Bing Translator widget in my content sidebar. And I'm going to just double-check my settings, which are exactly what I want, actually, and just click Save. So now when I look at this on the front end, I see the Bing Translator widget in my content sidebar, which is great. And when I click it, I can switch to, um, let's do Chinese, we can switch to any other language, and it translates really quickly. Um, one of the reasons that I really like this uh, here we can even do a Klingon. My favorite reason to use the WordPress widget when implementing the Bing Translator is that the Translator widget is going to show on every page that uses this content sidebar. So um, in the case of this site right here, this is our home page. We've got it translated into Klingon. When we go over to our About page, it loads, then it translates automatically. And we can go to our demo page, see Hello Dolly, and watch that translate automatically. Um, so without a doubt, the WordPress widget is the easiest way to add the Bing Translator to your website. In other videos, I'll talk about adding the Bing Translator via shortcode or via template tag. Thanks for watching.